Hey, what's going on guys? It's Matt from TechFanax TV and today I'm going to show you how to change the RAM in your MacBook Pro. For this process, what we're going to need is a double zero Phillips screwdriver and that's pretty much it. So first up, you want to shut down your MacBook Pro and flip over just like so. I do recommend you to put on something soft such as a towel or a blanket so it won't scratch your MacBook Pro up. Now there's going to be 10 screws you got to remove and keep in mind the 3 screws on the top right are longer screws so don't get them mixed up. Now you can keep all your screws in a tiny little water bottle cap so none of them get lost. Now you can go ahead and start unscrewing the lid of the MacBook Pro so just take some time with it so you don't strip the screws or you don't scratch the aluminum finish of the MacBook Pro. Once you have all the screws removed, you can grab a hold of the back and just pull it off just like so. There might be a little bit of resistance, but don't worry about that. So right above the battery is the RAM itself, and what you're going to want to do is find those two little levers on both sides and give it a quick little pull to the side, just like so, and the first RAM module should come up. I'm going to pull that out and set it aside and do the same for the second RAM module. This one's a little bit trickier to get out, so we're going to push on the two little levers again and give it a second little push so the RAM comes out as far as possible. Then we're going to want to take that out and set that aside. So here's what your RAM looks like. It's really no big deal, uh, but you want to keep it in a safe place so you can use it in the future. Now you're going to want to take your new RAM modules. In this case, I'm installing 8 gigs of RAM, 4 gigs on each module. And we're going to take that and we're going to install it back into the same place in the MacBook Pro. So what you're going to want to do is take first RAM module, it doesn't really matter which one. We're going to put it back in at approximately the same angle which we took it out in. And we're going to push it in all the way as far as it can go. Then we're going to push down on it and you should feel a little click. Sometimes it's an audible click and that's where you know you put it in right. Now we're going to take the second module and we're going to put it in the top slot. We're going to do the same thing, we're going to push it all the way in as far as possible and we're going to click that down. And that's pretty much it. So what you're going to want to do now is take the lid that you took off in the first place. We're going to put that back on and give it a quick little push, especially in the middle where uh, it will click back together. Now you want to put your screws back on. Remember the top three screws are longer screws, just like the ones you see on the video right now. So just keep that in mind. Now you can go ahead and screw all your screws back on. So as I said before, just take some time with it so you don't strip the screws and you don't also uh, scratch the aluminum finish on your MacBook Pro. After you screw them all back on, you flip your MacBook Pro over, open the lid up just like so and turn the power on. Once your MacBook Pro is all booted up, we're going to go up to the Apple on the top left, click about this Mac, and in the middle you should see the amount of RAM you put in, and in my case, 8 gigs of RAM. So if that matches the amount of RAM you installed, then you've done it correctly. So guys, that is how you install RAM on your MacBook Pro, and that's pretty much it. So guys, if you like this tutorial, please give it a thumbs up and remember to subscribe right at the top. If you have any questions about installing RAM or about the video itself, feel free to leave it down in the comment section below. Other than that, thanks for watching, and I'll catch you guys next time.